Hello students, welcome to my channel. Today I am going to discuss about design and implementation of correct, efficient and maintainable programs. So first you need to know what is program. So I already told in the last class program is nothing but set of instructions. Okay, program is nothing but set of instructions instructions are nothing but rules those rules those steps are used to solve one particular problem and next one is software so what is software software is nothing but collection of programs so here collection of programs are used to solve one particular problem okay collection of pro programs are used to solve specific problems those that is nothing but software okay so program development life cycle so here the program development life cycle involves six phases six steps okay so while developing the program you need to follow this life cycle okay so the first one is problem definition so what is the problem of okay what is the problem of program okay so what is the current problem and how to uh, solve that problem so what are the requirements of user okay so that is problem definition next one is problem analysis so problem analysis is nothing but how to solve that problem so what methods are used to solve that problem so we need to analyze the things next one is algorithm development so we know algorithm is nothing but step by step process these steps are used to solve particular problem okay next coding so coding is nothing but transformation of algorithm steps into coded format okay so the language is high level language by using high level language we need to write the program we need to implement the code next testing so if code contain any errors or bugs we need to rectify okay we need to test so that is testing and the last one is maintenance maintenance is nothing but we need to maintain the problem we need to maintain the software okay so let's see one by one the quality of software program depends on following factors those factors are correctness efficiency efficiency and maintainability third one is maintainability okay so these are the three factors the quality of software program depends okay so here correctness the extent to which program satisfies its specification and fulfill customer needs okay how we check the correctness of the program so let's take one software okay that software is whatsapp okay so whatsapp is a software so what are the problems that whatsapp solves whatsapp help us to communicate with people through messages audio calls video calls okay so we can communicate with people by using messages audio calls and video calls so here the user requirement is he need to communicate with other person by using that app okay so correctness of this software is checked the extent to which the program satisfies its specification and fulfills the customer needs so here the whatsapp is fulfills the customer needs that is messages audio calls and video calls so this software is correct this software program is correct okay so in this way we check the correctness next one is efficiency the amount of code computing resources required by a program to perform its functions okay so if a function if a program performs its function efficiently okay without any remark 
that is nothing but efficiency okay last one is maintainability the effort that is required to locate and fix errors in a program so the amount of efforts required to fix a errors in a program that is nothing but maintainability so it is the ease with which repair may be made at software made to the software during design we make decisions that will ultimately affects the success of software construction and and the ease with which the software can be maintained so implementation involves installing the program on end user machine okay so the implementation of a program is involves installing the program on end user machine so you need to uh, install the software on the end user so end user is nothing but end user is the person who who gave the requirements to the software engineer who software programmer the programmer is uh, the programmer the person who develops the program who develops the software okay so software and end user so this end user communicate software uh, programmer to develop one software and the software programmer takes the requirements of uh, end user and develops one software so that software should be if uh, correct and efficient and maintainable okay next when the user uses the software he comes to know shortcomings and drawbacks of the program if any okay so whenever the customer uses the software the software engineer comes to know comes to know the shortcomings okay so what are the uh, drawbacks and feedback he need to take from the user if the user informs to the developer okay the programmer can make changes modify the program based on the feedback of the user so based on the feedback of the user the programmer must make changes and modify the software program okay thus implementation can be viewed as the final testing phase so here correctness efficiency maintainability factors should be considered during design and implementation phase of the program development life cycle so while developing a program we need to take these three factors those are correctness efficiency and maintainability so by this this class is completed if you have any doubt please comment me in the comment section for more videos please subscribe my channel thank you